Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Michelle flies into rage at Barack after Melania makes brave move at funeral. First Lady Melania Trump was given top seating priority at the Barbara Bush funeral. Melania was seated next to the Obamas and the Clintons, surrounded by her husband's political opponents. What most people didn't see was Michelle flying into a rage, as she accosted Barack right there in the pew. This was all over Melania pulling an incredibly brave move. Don't miss this. A very big deal is being made out of Barack Obama sitting next to Melania Trump at Barbara Bush's funeral and chatting her up prior to the beginning of the ceremony. Obama sycophants are being rude and saying really terrible things like Melania's smiling at Barack because she knows he's a real president. The liberal media is covering for Michelle by putting the focus on Melania. Elle magazine reports, one picture in particular of the former POTUS and current FLOTUS has the Internet very pleased. In the photo, taken before the service began, Obama and Melania are seen talking and she is positively beaming at whatever Obama said to her. Elle includes leftist tweets to back up their claim, like this one they posted by Great Scott, who tweeted, Melania looks happier at a funeral than she has in ages. Wouldn't you too if you went from being with Donald every day to sitting next to Barack? They add, the general consensus on Twitter is that Melania looks happy for the first time in a while and it's quite the coincidence that it happens to be at an event, even a devastatingly sad one like a funeral, that she's attending without her husband. They must not have caught the former first lady flying into a rage as her husband bannered with Melania Trump. It was really evident that she was completely pissed off about Barack speaking with Melania. In fact, most mainstream outlets cut away from the scene, but we captured it. The Daily Caller reports, while Melania attended the funeral alone and was surrounded by her husband's political opponents, she was the beacon of class. Melania stood proud smiling and waving at those in the audience. Multiple times she could be seen laughing and creating polite conversation with her husband's predecessor, Barack Obama. The two could be seen smiling on multiple occasions together. It took guts for Melania to go solo to the Bush funeral. Imagine her plight, she's asked to represent the United States at the funeral of a very beloved former first lady who happens to be the mother of Jeb Bush, who the president trounced in the primaries. But it goes deeper than that. For Barbara Bush, it was always Jeb who would be president. That was her dream. She loved all her kids, but Barbara is on the record saying Jeb was the most responsible one and George W. had been rowdy and had some screw-ups. It's known that Barbara was at first angry George W. was going to run. So when it finally came time for her beloved Jeb to run, it was Melania's husband who destroyed him, utterly and completely. Mrs. Bush voted for Hillary Clinton, that's how deep her hurt was over the primaries. So knowing all that, Melania put on her best smile and owned her office as Flotus. She is respected and is the most distinguished guest on any list wherever she goes. Those old politicos attending the Bush funeral reacted to her strength owning her office and her incredibly brave move, showing up in spite of the possible hate some might show her. Except, there was Michelle who threw shade at her. Even though Michelle's reaction was covered up by the liberal press and the cameras cut away quickly, those paying attention saw the full Michelle on display. Virginia Girl tweeted, Michelle always looks so pissed off. She's probably mad that Barack is flirting with Melania. Michelle could not hide her contempt for Barack chatting up Melania, no matter what the nutjob leftists are trying to sell about Melania. Freedom Watcher tweeted, The more important question, what joke is Barack and Melania sharing? They are having a good time and Michelle looks pissed off. Then came the reception event which was private, but Michelle, Barack, Melania, and the Clintons were all on hand. One Twitter user named Chill Candace noticed where Michelle was standing at in this pic with the Bush family. She tweeted, Michelle separated Barack and Melania. By golly she did. Well, for once I have to hand it to Barack Obama. It would have been so much easier if Michelle Obama could have overcome her cattiness and put politics aside for one day. It's widely known Melania Trump never had any desire to be the first lady, and if anyone knows what it feels like having all that pressure on you, it's Michelle Obama. Melania Trump's pressure is ten times worse than Michelle Obama's as the first lady. Michelle wanted a life in politics, Michelle wasn't speaking a second language, and no one dared throw shade at Michelle as Flotus or they'd be called racist. Melania Trump proved at the funeral that she has so much strength, class, and grace. She will no doubt go down as one of our most beloved first ladies ever, just like Barbara Bush. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like and subscribe. Thank you.